think I woke the camp up with a bang, 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 bang. I'm a bit tired this morning. Why? These keys here, I let him have one of the fobs in case he needed to go not, to the car. I told you not to do it. Yeah, but I thought you might need to go to the car, so I let him have one of these. And basically, you see that panic button? Well, like an idiot, he... No, it wasn't like an idiot. Well, well it was, because you slept in your shorts. No, I did not. I was putting my shorts on and I was filming at the same time, right? <laughs> ready to show the viewers what it's like when you get up in the morning, right? And uh, this happened. Uh, woke the whole camp up, woke me up. I couldn't f turn it off. I've just discovered that the reason he hit the panic button was because a little tiny ant ran over his foot. Yeah, I did panic because it had big teeth and it bit me actually on the ankle. Even though how small it was, oh it had big teeth. Oh my god. <sighs> Coffee time. Wash day. Yesterday's vlog, sorry about that, it was a bit boring, we had to drive for five hours. We got lost in uh, Mississippi, in the outback of Mississippi. We went to a general store. It's like a scene from Deliverance. It was like a scene from Deliverance, seriously now. Ooh, my um, piggy now. Oh, squeal, squeal. <laughs> On the floor, not behind the counter, just this massive stack, thousands and thousands of boxes of bullets. <sighs> yeah. Don't say that stuff back home, do we? Massive mate? knives, hunting gear, crossbows. Where you boys from? And we were like, oh mm. shit. Nope. You got some New York license plates, you must be from New York. And, uh. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's accent there, man. That's all right. I don't think that's exactly right. I don't want you people from Mississippi getting upset now. I'm just doing it. I'm just trying my best to do your accent. It's not good. So anyway, that was a bit scary. And then we decided that we wasn't going to stay there. And we carried on driving. And eventually, on Google Maps, on my phone, I found a place called Jellystone Park. It's absolutely gorgeous. Right next to the washrooms. We pitched a tent. Anyway, we've been on the road 11 days. And my nephew would be well fed up with us if we don't do this. Because he worked really hard before we went away to make us some stickers for our car. He did. We're gonna be getting some more made up in smaller version. So if you want one, subscribe to the channel. And if you ask us, we'll send you one for free. Yeah, like that. All you have to pay for is the postage, which is uh, 37 pounds 50, isn't it? I think oh, for, yeah, yeah some, nah. some, something. About I'll it. send it to you for free. Yeah, look, that's going on really nice. Got a few air bubbles in it. I didn't do your uh, car sticker, much proud, but there we go. Subscribe to the pimple list, boys. No. There's more pimples on that than there was on my face when I was 17. <laughs> we drove driving here last night. Couldn't see any of it. What a place of beauty. Make sure you follow these bucket list boys as they travel across the southern part of the United States now. They're going to Florida. They're real nice folks. They're taking a lot of photographs. Follow them on YouTube and on Instagram. The Bucket List Boys UK. Fascinating people. Okay, folks, we're leaving Jellystone Park, the home of Yogi Bear and Boo Boo. We're in Louisiana, going towards New Orleans. Just come to a toll road that says tag or cash. We don't have any cash. And I don't even know what the tag is. So I sent the boy in to find out. 13 miles to go on the bridge, mate. 
How long was it? About 20, 20 miles. <laughs> well, I'm, I'm saying the signs at 20. Pretty big, to be honest. Yes. I think it's called a bridge too far. I'm sure it is. Do you reckon that is New Orleans over there? That is New Orleans. Over there. It is. Yeah. with no 3G on your phone is when you take a wrong turning it tries to reroute and with no 3G it can't reroute we need to find somewhere to stay he just went to the holiday and this will be funny the rate for tonight sir is 134 plus tax seriously people pay that kind of money must be mad don't pay that kind of money for these places this is ripping you off Anyway, we ain't got anywhere to stay, so it's probably better than this car. You've only got to be in a right-hand lane, and we want to go left, and there's no chance of it. We're on the road to nowhere. 